one will be appointed to you by state if available. Do you see your rights? Yes. Thanks. I didn't do anything wrong, Slex. Slex, I told you guys I am two weeks away from my expungement. Okay, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's start from the beginning. Okay, start from the beginning. Start from the beginning, okay? Who organized the transport and what happened? Second, let me. Uh... You guys talked to Carmine yet? He has. I'm not. Bobby, tell the fucking truth. It's not that hard. I have told you the goddamn truth. Then give it to me one more time now. A work release trip. Okay. Okay. A work release trip occurred. With the warden, Carmine Costello, me being a, not even the deputy warden, according to the council, just a normal guard grunt. With the following individuals, Mr. K, Mr. Kevin Zolo Levy, I think that's how you pronounce it, uh, Vinny Pistone, and Rami El Ramen. So it's only four? Yes. Oh, wait, and uh, Kelly was in there. This is from my perspective. That's who was on the bus. That that's who was on the bus. What about Peanut and Taco? Uh, they weren't in prison. <sighs> Great. Okay, keep going. After that, they were all lined up. Put in the bus. Richard was in his mammoth. Gary Kevin was on his ATV. I said, Carmine, this is a really bad idea. Something bad is bound to happen. I informed the police. I said, hey, Warden Carmine is doing the transport. Warden Carmine is doing the transport. And then after that, I called you slacks. During the ride, I said, "This is what we're doing. This is what we're doing." Well, but did you okay. call? Did you call the police before calling me? Uh, you are the police, Lex. No, I'm saying, did you call anybody else before calling me? No, no, no. You were okay. the only call. So I called Slacks to inform about, about transport happening and then what? And then <laughs> when we entered the airlock, I told Carmine, "Are you really sure you want to do this? Because this is probably going to end up very badly." Hello. Oh my god. What the wrong with this guy? She told Carmine it was a really, really bad idea, and were you against it? He said I was against it, that's why he called the goddamn police. But we've done prison transports before. So Carmine continued with the transport, made it down the road. Richard was in front of us. What? I, I, Richard was in front of us. Gary was behind us on the ATV. And then we pulled over, and a lot of cops showed up. Mm, okay, hold on. Um. So who organized the work release trip? Whose idea was it? Warden. Okay. And then who was part of it? Uh, it's not, not, the, not the inmates, just the DOC. Okay. Gary Kevin, Winslow Jackson, Richard Wayotick. And that's the only people who were on duty. What about Lily and uh, duty. Andrew? They were off duty? Off duty. Who was, so, so the DOC members were part of transport. Was it you, Carmine, Winslow, Richard, and Gary? And Timo, right? Yes. And T Timo doesn't have a job. But yeah. He was is, is Winslow DOC? Because somebody said he was removed or fired or something. No, he was never fired. Okay, so Winslow was, was not fired. Timo was. Timo what is his songs I have right now, Judd? Oh, I thought he was... Okay, is he trying to get hired by you guys? 
or well yeah. by DLC. Okay. But now, now it's all over because Carmichael shit is. He's a felon. What? Timo's a felon. But Timo got expunged. Why do you sound like that? He 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 had an accident. He um. Sounds like he's got like one of those voice modulators. Ah, uh, yeah, his uh, throat was slice affecting his voice box. Okay, can you use sign language? Because it's kind of gross. No. Jack, that's fucked okay, up. Just, Come on, just... he, he he's suffering said, from please. an injury. Okay, um, uh, Decker, do you have any questions for Bobby? Um, Bobby, did you? I, I I wasn't in the room, so I I didn't hear if he said it. Did you tell Carmine that you didn't agree with this? Yeah, Carmine yeah. even said that. What that he didn't agree with it? No, Carmine even said earlier. This was all his fault. I informed you guys. You guys could okay, not. I'm just trying to get the right info. With prison break. I told you guys. He was my boss. I'm following the chain of command. We've done prison transports. Place before, a statement there. Nothing this severe. Okay, so with that being said, how did you, like, what were the words that you used to tell him? Oh, I'm an LT now. All right, this is really bad. Something bad is going to happen, and we're probably all going to get fired. Okay. Oh, so literally what happened? Uh, okay. Um,. Did you see Carmine on the phone at all? Like texting, calling, anything like that? But you guys, you guys think that. Okay, so what you guys think? You guys think that we organized an escape so they could all leave? Uh, well, right now it's sounding like Carmine, not everybody. I, no, I, I mean I was in the bus. Then the, I got out of the bus. The gunshots started ringing off. Before, Everybody before the broke. transport started, did you see him on the phone? Is what I'm saying. No. Mm. Okay, so. You said earlier that you felt it was Richard that was the one that contacted them? I mean, Richard is is a very snaky man. Is he, uh, is Carmine, he DOC? Uh, yeah, yeah. Carmine did say that Richard attacked him. I, I thought, wasn't there when none of that happened. I, I thought Richard was fired. Was he never well, removed? I mean, I mean, listen, if I would have been demoted by the council, yeah, I would have fired his ass a long time ago. And I would have fired Scotty. And I would have fired Lily, and I would have hired the best of the goddamn best, and this never would have happened. But I'm not okay, the so, one anymore. So the, just to clarify, Richard was supposed to be fired, but before you could do it, you were demoted. Wanted him fired. Okay, why are you not able to fire people as a deputy warden?